So looking ahead to, to when you're back and better than ever, say um, several years from now, you know, knock on wood, um, the pandemic is, is a thing of the past. Um, and if you look toward expansion with these franchise valuations in mind, again, as of, as of now, the $2.4 billion average that we calculated, um, what might you be looking at in terms, of, in terms of a number and how many teams might you be looking at at that time? You know, Peter, I'm, I'm not ready to say a number or a number of teams yet. I think clearly, though, your valuations are showing that some of the reported numbers are, are very low in terms of an, a notion of a value at which we expand. I think, remember, the other side of the coin is that as we see these valuations go up, the, the math isn't as obvious as many people might think for expansion because in essence, at the end of the day, we're selling equity in our league by mm -hmm. virtue of expansion. And if you're selling equ equity, part of the calculation, therefore, needs to be what will 130th, 131st, 132nd of our team be in the future? And so, you know, to me, ultimately, the main driver for expansion should be the ability to grow the pie, not necessarily to bring in, you know, to sell equity, to bring in cash now you know, as opposed to generating the money later. I'd, I'd also say there, there are other significant issues around a pan pandemic in that um, related to expansion in that I, it doesn't feel necessarily like the right time to be diverting our attention to expansion as we're just doing everything we can to work through the day. I know you have Michelle Roberts coming on later. Part of expansion requires an amendment to the collective bargaining agreement and determining how you disperse players who are now under contract, how a draft would work, et cetera. So, you know, it's, I, I would only say, I, I've said this before, I think it's inevitable at some point that we will turn back to expansion. I think successful organizations tend to grow over time, but it, it, it doesn't feel like this is the right moment to do that.